I'll be demonstrating and instructing how to make a rustic candle holder, wire candle holder. So before we begin, you want to be gathering some materials and some uh, some stuff for your, uh, your little project. So we want to find something around the house or go to the store or something, uh, buy, find some wood, you know, that'll hold a candle, something that's about one inch. You know, four inches by three inches or four inches by four inches base. So when you put your candle, it won't tip over. And you want to go out and you want to buy some uh, small candles, about five, six inches long or however they come. Then you want to get some uh, 18 gauge wire right here. You want to get some uh, some strong glue, some uh, multi-purpose or all-purpose uh, some glue. You get you some wire cutters, get some drill bits, and of course your drill. Alright, so now we have all the materials, so we're going to put this little thing together here. So first you want to take a piece of wood, you want to drill a hole. Alright, before you drill a hole you want to make sure that the 18 gauge wire and the drill bit are about the same. All right. So you want to take your hole, drill your hole here, not in the center, you want to do it a little offset from the center. Alright, so you can go ahead and drill. Alright, now you got your hole. Now that you got your hole, you're going to take your wire and you're going to cut it about 18 inches long, about this long, 18 inches. Alright, then you're going to take your glue. You're going to put it down on here, in the hole. Alright, once it's in the hole, let the wire sit for a good 15-20 minutes. Let it dry and make sure it's strong. Once it dries, it's going to be hard to come out. Alright, so now you take your small candle here, you're going to put it down right next to the wire. I'm just going to wrap it around nice and tight. About a couple inches at the end. Then you're gonna take your needle nose or cutters. And you're gonna make like a little curly cue. Just like that. All right. Once you have it done, you're pretty much done. And now you can light your candle. Now you're good to go with the candle. See? And it's pretty sturdy. So now we got our candle going. Now you can use these things around the house, power goes out or whatever, something really easy, cheap, and you don't have to worry about, you know, the expensive co uh, candle holders. So now you have something really cheap. Messes up, you can always make one another one. So thank you for your time. If you have any questions, just uh, get with me afterwards.